Round two. You know what I like? What? Round two. You like round two? I like when the rounds keep going. Oh, Tipling Tuesdays? <laughs> no. I enjoy that. Ding, 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 ding. What ding. do we have now? Okay. In this shiny, pretty can. Let's get the business end of the business out of the way. Click that subscribe button. Click that comment button. If you like the review, give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment. But please, 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 be polite. Thank you. That's, you know, just part of the game, man. I might give you a thumbs down. Ah, please. <laughs> I expected that. I expected, like, the, uh, the sledge o upside the head. You know what I'm saying there, Gallagher? Now I'm a hack comedian. <laughs> No, you just like to smash no, watermelons. With I, do the, like this, I do like to smash things. It's, it's good true. fun. Jimmy Smash. <laughs> okay. All right. All I right. want to go like candy. Okay. Are you done? <laughs> Jesus. This is why people don't, don't, don't subscribe. They clicked off already, didn't they? They clicked off a long time ago. All right. So we got a Festina Pesh from the fine folks of Milton, Delaware. Dogfish Head Brewery. 4.5% ABV. Making its comeback as a variety pack exclusive. Festina Pesh is a... Tart and refreshing Neo Berliner Weiss brewed with lactic acid and boatloads of peaches. That boatloads is a, of peaches? That is, that is much, much more effervescent than I remember. Boatloads of peaches? Have, you've had this, haven't you? I have had this. I haven't had this in a, in a few years, and Not I thought in it was a I bit think of a while. I remember really, really, really liking this. This is one of my favorite beers from this, from this place. Cheers. So, oh, that is peachy. It it tart. Is tart and peachy. And, and wheat. You get the is that the Berliner Weiss? Yeah, that's right. Because right? it's like a it's like a tart wheat beer, right? Like the wheat. Yep, it's it's a nice. So it has beer. like that, that wheat malt. A little bit of a little bit of coriander, maybe. Not quite peach pie. No, 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 no. This is like a tart peach. This yeah. is like a this is like a not yet ripe. You now when you bite into crunchy it, crunchy and yeah. a little bit sour. By the way, don't dip your nose too close into the beer because then it goes up. Is that what happens? happens to me. Yeah, I got a little bit of nose. Yeah, it did. It was a little embarrassing. <sighs> smells good. Smells good. Trying to wet your beak. You're I wetting your beak. I literally wet my beak. Wet your beak. You I went in. It's uh, not very carbonated, very creamy, and a lot of peaches. I find it a little fizzy. Yeah, but it's not overly carbonated. I mean, no, there's some fizz to it. No, I'm getting like you know it's Lovely interesting because I don't remember getting like the coriander so much. Yeah. I got a little bit of coriander, and then I get a lot of peach. A peach. A lot of peach. I don't think it's overly tart though. No, no, no. And the oh. finish is very nice. It doesn't get like tartar as you go through no. it. A little drying, but not overly dry. It's very nice. Mm. I can see this is a nice summer beer. Nice hot day. Kicking back. It's absolutely a summer having beer. A and I think this is having a few of these. This is exclusively for summer. Am I correct? Uh, it's in their variety pack. Yep. Right. Yep. And in, also in the pack is slightly mighty four percent ABV. I guess it's a low cal IPA. And then a 60-minute IPA, which is not necessarily low-cal, but no, it's a damn good beer. That's a good beer. That's a damn good beer. It's good beer. So it's a nice so, variety pack. It's uh -huh. not, you know, some things you're trying to get rid of or some experimentation no. beers that you're hoping for the best. What's nice about that pack is a little bit for everybody. Yeah. Someone that likes a really nice, really hoppy beer could have a 60-minute. Someone who's kind of like, I like IPA, but not too much, and I don't want it too heavy. They get the light IPA, and then you've got this, yeah. which is completely different. But this is really, really nice. Now, I'm a fan of fruity beers, um, blueberries, raspberries, things mm -hmm. with berries in them. This is very nice. It is. It's very, really, really mm. nice. It's nice. Again, it's like it's like a nice, like tart peach. And it, it still stays a beer without yeah. being a cider, without no, being some know. sort of cloyingly jam kind of thing we've made. You know, I gotta it's say, nice. actually, I think it's better than I remember because it's a little more fizzy. And, and I, a I, little bit more fruity and just... And I looked at your review before, yeah. and you seemed to really enjoy it. So, if you like it even more now. I did. That's nice. I like these light, refreshing nice. beers from yeah. them. This one I'm a big fan of, and I love the Sequench. Yeah. Sequench, like whenever we go to Central Taco, if I'm not having a cocktail, I like the Sequench, and they usually have it on tap. And that's really good with food, and I can yeah. see this being good with food as well. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. So, I mean, honestly, for what it is, I give, it a, I give this a solid A. I yeah. Mean, I know it's not your wheelhouse exactly. Oh, this is B plus for me. I mean, okay. I don't know if it goes as far as an A. This is an 88, 89, somewhere mm -hmm. around there. I go 90, 91 on this. I just, I just like it. It's just really, really good. But it's, it's a very good beer. Really and nice. I haven't had this in probably a good three, four years. And I'm glad to see that it's still consistent and really good. And, and I, possibly better. And I like the can. It's very pretty. The can's very nice. It's, very it's cool, can. too, because they give you like all the ingredients. A little bit of everything. Our Neo Berliner Royce fermented with boatloads of peaches is a tart and refreshing warm weather companion. Absolutely. Absolutely. So thank you to the fine folks at Dogfish Head yeah. for sending this along. Kudos on continuing to make a good solid beer. Damn right. Cheers. Cheers.